Good morning, this is Brittany. Hey Brittany, this is Jim Gregg. I'm in slot four and it's route 4A. When the volunteer shows up, they have their route code right here. And then every day we give them a new pass key. Now we've got all the people that we have to deliver to. Meals on Wheels provides that hot meal each day. This organization provides so many wonderful services in our community. We touch so many people on a daily basis. Okay. We can't do this program without our volunteers. It's funny, when you're driving with the actual meals, you start thinking about the people you're about to see and what they've been facing, who's in their family. By the time you get there, it's like, I know them, I'm glad to see them. This is an old friend. Thank you, we so appreciate it. <laughs> All right, I can tell he does. It's been an unprecedented time for all of us. COVID really brought to the attention the vulnerability of seniors. We experienced such a high volume of calls from people who needed food. At our peak, we were serving 16,000 meals a month. Not only am I concerned about continue to feed everyone we are now, but also be able to start helping those that have asked for food. We are always looking for more volunteers. A volunteer gets to choose what days they want. Touching base and making sure people are safe is so important beyond the meals. I personally have had an incident where I went to the home and rang the bell and the man yelled out, help me, help me. So if Meals on Wheels hadn't come, who knows how long he would have been there. <laughs> I have certainly developed friendships with my clients and many of them are excited to see me. It's reassuring to have someone come by on a regular basis. You know what's going to happen on Monday morning. I'm going to show up with a meal for you. To see the smiles, to see the joy, and to know that they've got a prime quality meal coming to them. These Meals on Wheels are very essential for our community and for all our seniors. Meals on Wheels certainly opened up both of our eyes that in this wealthy community, we have pockets of people that certainly need help. Thank you.